They are one of the most popular gospel singing groups in America. Now three of the four Grammy-nominated singers have perished in a plane crash in Wyoming. The Neelands were on their way to perform on a cruise, and right before boarding, they posted what would be their last video on the tarmac. We are on our way. We just landed in Nebraska. It's haunting final video of the gospel group The Neelands on the tarmac with their doomed plane. And then we're stopping. Where are we going? Montana. Montana. Three members of the popular group were killed when the plane broke up in midair. The video was posted less than two hours before the crash, which also killed the group's assistant along with the pilot and his wife. There's our wonderful pilot. This is the dude right there. This is Larry. This is the co pilot. This is the co pilot. The gospel singers, who are based in Georgia, were making a series of pit stops on the way to Seattle, where they were scheduled to perform on a cruise ship to Alaska. Before the plane went down, Kelly Nealon posted a photo from inside the aircraft with the message, Wheels up, Seattle, here we come. Pray for a good, smooth flight and no storms. The plane crashed in a remote area of Wyoming. Minutes earlier, the pilot reported a problem with the autopilot. Dr. Bob Arnott, who is an experienced pilot, told Inside Edition what he believes happened. All of a sudden, the plane starts to pitch down, and it pitches up, and it pitches down, and it pitches up. And an autopilot issue. And apparently enough at 300 miles an hour that it tore the plane apart. Family member Todd Nealon posted this tearful video. Our world has been rocked. Un unlike anything we've ever seen. The last surviving member of the group, Autumn Nealon, was not on the flight. She chose ground transportation because she's pregnant. She posted, I don't have the words to comprehend how I feel right now, and I'm not sure when I will. All right, we'll check in later. Eight years ago, the Nealons were inducted into the Gospel Music Association's Hall of Fame.